Performance Indicators KPIs in HSE Management Welcome to this session on Key Performance Indicators or KPIs in HSE Management. Key Performance Indicators KPIs are measurable values that indicate how effectively an organization is achieving its objectives in specific areas. Purpose in HSE the ultimate purpose is to align daily operations with the goal of zero harm, ensuring the safety of people, assets, and the environment. Why are KPIs essential? They hold teams accountable. Provide measurable evidence of progress. Identify areas needing improvement. Enable informed decision-making to guide strategic actions. Now, Let's dive deeper into what KPIs are and how they function in HSE management. What are KPIs? KPIs are the foundation of tracking success in HSE management. They fall into two primary categories. Proactive KPIs, leading indicators focus on efforts made to prevent incidents before they occur. Reactive KPIs, Lagging indicators focus on outcomes and insights gathered after incidents have occurred. This dual approach ensures a balanced safety strategy, focusing not only on preventing risks but also on learning from past experiences to improve systems. Proactive KPIs, prevention is key. This table shows a summary of these proactive KPIs, with measurable targets like 100% compliance for inspections or 10 reports per month for near-miss reports. These clear targets make it easier to track and ensure that safety standards are consistently met. Proactive KPIs are preventive measures that reduce risks and strengthen safety performance. When these KPIs are properly implemented, they create a strong safety culture where hazards are addressed proactively and risks are minimized before they escalate. These KPIs emphasize the importance of addressing potential hazards and strengthening the workforce's readiness. For instance, spot cards document safe and unsafe practices, creating a transparent system to encourage timely corrective actions and improvements. Reactive KPIs – Learning from the Past This table outlines these reactive KPIs with specific targets such as zero environmental breaches or MVIF is equal to 0, 0.0, showing a strong commitment to preventing harm and maintaining a safe working environment. While proactive KPIs focus on prevention, reactive KPIs help us measure and learn from the outcomes of incidents. By focusing on past incidents, these KPIs enable organizations to perform root cause analysis and make data-driven decisions for improvement. These KPIs highlight areas requiring attention and improvement. For example, tracking environmental breaches ensures the company remains compliant while prioritizing sustainability. When reactive KPIs reveal gaps, they prompt root cause analysis, enabling corrective actions and preventing similar incidents in the future. Steps to set and monitor KPIs To maximize the impact of KPIs, follow these key steps. Identify key activities, focus on critical safety and environmental operations relevant to your organization's goals. Define clear objectives, for example, reduce waste by 10% or achieve 100% training compliance. Assign ownership, allocate specific KPIs to teams or individuals. Implement tracking mechanisms, use tools like dashboards or software to monitor KPIs in real time. Regular review and feedback, hold periodic reviews to assess progress and refine strategies. By interconnecting proactive and reactive KPIs, your organization creates a cycle of continuous improvement, preventing incidents while learning from the past. Continual improvement, the path forward. The journey to zero harm doesn't stop at setting KPIs. 
It's about evolving strategies every year. Set annual objectives based on trends in KPIs, such as reducing kilometers driven or increasing near-miss reporting. Communicate goals, ensure all stakeholders are aware of updated objectives. Celebrate milestones, recognize achievements to motivate teams. Continuous improvement relies on integrating feedback, analyzing trends, and fostering a culture of accountability. Practical Tips for Safety Professionals Here's how safety professionals can lead the way. Promote accountability, make sure everyone understands their role in achieving KPI targets. Leverage technology, use digital tools to simplify data collection and reporting. Engage the workforce, encourage participation through toolbox talks and interactive sessions. Celebrate successes, acknowledge milestones to maintain motivation and adherence to safety practices. In conclusion, KPIs are the cornerstone of effective HSE management. They provide insights that not only prevent incidents, but also build a culture of safety and sustainability. By implementing a balanced approach with proactive and reactive KPIs, organizations can achieve their ultimate goal, zero harm. This is all about today's topic. Thanks for watching Funny EHS Info. And don't forget to subscribe our channel to get immediate notification of our videos. Share our videos to your friends and colleagues to create safety awareness. If you have any questions and requirements, please comment in comment box.